Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to go over Worthy by Elevation Worship. Uh, we're going to be in E flat. So E flat is E flat, F, G, A flat, B flat, C, D, and then back to E flat. Okay. So that we're just going to talk about the course and we're going to talk about how we can kind of change it up, swap it up, do some things to, to beef it up a little bit. Uh, the four main chords is A flat. So we're just going to do a regular A flat right now. So it's worthy is your name, A flat. And then Jesus is B flat. You deserve the praise, E flat over G. And then worthy is your name, a C minor chord. Okay. So regular A flat major. Regular B flat. E flat over G. And then C minor. All right, so first of all, what we're going to use some concepts. We're going to do some inversions. We're going to use the melody a little bit. Uh, we're going to do uh, a, add a couple, like a passing chord or so. Uh, we're going to just spice this up a little bit. Um, and uh, I'm going to just show you how you can kind of change it. All right, so first off, worthy is your name. We're going to use this an A flat in the in the right hand okay but I'm gonna be with a C at the top so worthy is your name that's the melody all right so we're gonna do E flat A flat B flat C is what I'm doing like a, a, a flat at the nine I got it in my right hand and then my left hand I got A flat B flat and you can even add the A flat again if you want but so worthy is your name okay so then what we're gonna do is you're gonna say G on the first part of G Jesus, right? We're gonna do it, hit that C again, all right, and then we're gonna come over to a C minor seven or minor nine, all right. So that G is in the top, and then E flat, D, B flat in the right hand, C, G in the left hand, all right, and then we're gonna do a, a B flat suspended. So that's F, E flat, B flat, starting from top, right to left, on your right hand, and then in the left hand, from left to right, B flat. I'll try to get them all one direction, sorry. So from left to right, everything. So left hand, B flat, F, right hand, B flat, E flat, F, and then we're going to resolve that by moving that E flat to a D. So that gets you the your name, all right? G sucks, all right? And then you deserve, so that's E flat, G. And I'm going to do a regular E flat over G. So that's G in the left hand. And I may throw the D in there, okay? In the left hand, and then E flat, F, G, B flat, okay? And then what we're going to do is there's two things you can do right here. One, you can just take the right hand and you can say, worthy is your name. Okay? So you can, that what that is, is just taking that and hitting the B flat, A flat, G, F, and then do a C minor, 7, with the E flat on top. So that's C in the bass, G, B flat, C, E flat in the right hand. And, right, and that gets you back. That's the end, right? So that's again, we're on. Worthy is your name. Okay. Now you can get really crazy and do a chord, <coughs> excuse me, for each one. And so you can do. So you can do like a, keep that same, and then D, make it like a, a suspended kind of chord in your right hand. So I basically, I, I take the B flat off and move it, move my ring finger to an A flat. So I still got the G in the bass, and then D in the bass. But then I'm doing E flat, F, uh, G, and 
A flat in the right hand. So I'm moving it from a B flat two in the right hand to an like an E flat suspended chord. Right? Okay. Which makes it a kind of a crazy uh, G chord. So worthy. And then I'm gonna do it a regular E flat, which is just an inversion. So B flat, E flat, G, okay? So we got B flat, like an E flat two or E flat nine. Then I'm going to move that B flat to just an A flat. And then I'm going to invert that E flat. Okay. And then I'm going to do a funky chord here to get the F. In the... All right. So it's a G7 flat nine because I'm not moving the bass, but on the right hand, I'm doing A flat, B, D, F, and then to that C minor seven. Okay. So for the A. So all together. So that's just kind of some things you can do to spice up that worthy. And if you want, you can just kind of switch that up after you build up or, you know, you can do that when you're soft and then go back to the regular chords when you build up. Like you can just do a couple different things, but that's just very repetitive, you know. That's just a little way of how we could take a, a simple worship chorus like Worthy. We can just add a little bit of fat chords in there, some passing chords. We can use the melody to create some stuff. Uh, so feel free to be a little creative, uh, you know, and take that melody line and, and use it to figure out some passing chords or to create some chords or even some riffs off of that. So sometimes I'll do, you know, going back into it. Flutter off that A flat to B flat to that C to that. What? Like that. So I hope this helps you incorporate some of the concepts I've been teaching into just everyday play. Have a great day.